Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. My name is Margaret and welcome to Purple Frog. Today I just got in this super exciting package from eBay. It contains my dream figure or one of my dream figures. I am a little bit nervous since I package is quite small. Um, yeah, I ordered it from eBay, which does not have a reputation for being the most trustworthy, trustworthy place to buy figures. So I'm crossing my fingers. I did not get scammed. The pictures looked authentic. The figure looked authentic. So without further ado, let's get into it. I'm really hoping I didn't get scammed. <laughs> so here's the package. I got it from a seller in the UK, I believe. I ordered it around a month ago and it took a month to arrive, but I'm very excited to get it open. So let's open it. Um, I am so excited because I have been wanting this figure for literally like a couple of years. He was like a grail of mine. Um, and he was originally like, I wanna say maybe 13,000 yen, I wanna say. Um, but his after sale puts him at like $400 sometime. So I was very nervous. Um, okay. Ah, okay. Okay, um, this is the Natsume's Book of Friends uh, altar figure. I got <laughs> nervous for a second because I wanted the renewal one. Um, there is a uh, original and a renewal. Uh, the original is more like manga accurate and the renewal is more like anime accurate. And I just really liked his facial sculpt on the renewal better. <laughs> When I saw this, I was like, oh no, <laughs> is this the um, original, but ah, I'm so excited. I love altar figures. They're such good quality. And I found this guy for, I want to say around like, um, how much was he? I think it was like 175 with shipping and I was like that is such a great deal I cannot pass up on him oh my god he is so cute um there is also a another figure of him I forgot who did it but it's really pretty I love the background on that so I'd like to get that one as well but I am so excited he looks so good I love clear boxes like this with like decoration I just think it's really nice how you can see the figure and Ah, oh, I'm so excited. So let's get him open. He is pre-owned, so he is not brand new. I was just, I just so excited when I found him because all the other figures I was seeing were so much more expensive and I actually found him for a reasonable price. So his box is really beautiful. You kind of have this really gorgeous shrine background. I think really just compliments um, him and really makes him look very ethereal. Oh. oh my gosh, look at him! Wow, he is stunning. Oh my god, look at the little Nyanko Sensei. <laughs> He is so cute. I believe he is a 1/7th. He is definitely like one of my tiniest figures. He is like really tiny. Like he's the size of my hand. Um Yeah, oh my god, he is so cute. <laughs> um yeah, I love Alter figures. Alter is such a great uh, figure manufacturer. Um so you can always tell when they have good quality. Um yeah, I was really torn between this one and the original because I liked this, um, I liked the Renewal's uh, facial sculpt better and like hair sculpt, but I liked the um, original's base better. I thought um, it just was better sculpted and I also liked the original Nyanko Sensei a little bit better. 
So I was very much torn between the two. Um, but ultimately I was like, yo, it's his face. And if I'm correct, I believe this like little yukata, I believe it is, is removable. Oh, wow. This is really nice. It's really nice quality. I love the design on it. It's beautiful. And it looks like he is in great condition. Oh, I like, look a little Nyonko Sensei's little paw. That's so cute. Um, I love the attention to detail on this figure. It is literally gorgeous. I really love um, bases that are, have more of a natural vibe to them. Um, there's a construction site right outside my house. I apologize, but I... When I saw him, he really just kind of checked all the boxes for me. Um, he really checked all the boxes for me. He's very kind of like, I don't know, just really captures his personality, you know? Very kind of quiet, serene, in my opinion. I just love the vibe of this figure. It is so cute. I will be displaying him with his like little yukata on. Cause, oh my God, am I putting it on upside down? <laughs> but I just love him so much. Yeah, because, like, compared to, like, my one-ninth of, like, Tsukasa, he is, like, so tiny. Like, he's, he's, like, the size of my hand, and I have tiny hands. So, yeah, I just, he is so beautiful. Like, does this, isn't this so, like... <sighs> and before anyone asks, I... Now I feel like I really have to get into Not To Make Book Of Friends um, because while I have watched the anime, I have not read the manga. And now I feel like I kind of have to collect the manga because I mean, how could I not? Yeah, he is just so beautiful. I love how he has the little book and then I just, everything is just so well balanced. And I also like love the gradient of like the transitions and the grass and the puddle or like the water is really well textured. Normally I'm not a big fan of Alter's water bases like on the um, Hashira figures like of Gyu and of Shinobu. I don't really like how those bases look in my opinion but I think they really nailed it on just the texture and whatnot on this one. The one kind of drawback that really kind of drew me away from the renewal and that is I didn't really like this kind of harsher edge. The original had a more of a smoother edge which I liked. I will say the other day I realized like I have a lot of my figures don't have shoes on. Just a random thing I was gonna say but yeah I really like natural bases. It's always just been like a personal preference. I just think Figures wearing more traditional clothing with more natural bases are just what I tend to like more and I'm really working on trying to have better theming for my figures so I think he will look great next to Tsukasa and like Penny Maru even though they give off completely different vibes I feel like the bases kind of all tie them back together because like Tsukasa has like the rocks and Penny Maru has like the fire and then Natsume here has like water and grass so I think it really covers all the bases and he is just so stunning I literally cannot get over it like definitely I'm putting in so much b-roll because I love him so much. I also like love this like little tree and I love how Nyanko sensei is just chilling. You know, they're so cute. Oh my god, like he is so beautiful. I will always gush about this figure. Uh, I will say if there's one thing in my opinion that could be improved on, it is I guess the seam and his head. But also his hand sculpt isn't the best. Um. I have the uh, Saber Altar Ch Heroic Spirits Traveling um, by Good Smile and her hand sculpts are flawless. They are stunning. The shading that sculpt, the posing, it's all beautiful. So I guess my expectations probably have been set a little too high. His hands are sculpted kind of funny in my opinion. They just look a little off. Um, but overall, he is so beautiful. I think they really nailed him. There is not much shading on this figure since it is an older figure. Um, but I will say the, the shading that they did do like on the branch, for instance, and like on the water and the base is where the majority of the shading is. It looks beautiful. 
His hair also has some shading and it looks so good. I love his face so much. Ah, he's such a gorgeous figure. If you guys have the opportunity to pick him up for a reasonable price, I cannot recommend him enough. He is gorgeous, especially if you love especially if you love Natsume's Book of Friends. This is definitely a must because he is just such a good quality. I also a good thing about his size is that since he is on the smaller side, he is just a great figure to have even if you don't have that much room to display him because he is a smaller figure. He is also just incredibly high quality in my opinion. And especially for the price that I paid, I really got my money's worth. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I am in love with Natsume. His sculpt and just the colors, the pose and everything is so perfect just as much as I was hoping it to be. Um, I put him on the top shelf of my manga bookcase and he looks great next to my Hunter Hunter and Banana Fish manga. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't forget to comment, write a like, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys! <laughs>